Hello, I'm Kelly Jackson, Executive Director with Passion Parties, and today I'm going to talk to you about invitation systems and making sure that you get people at your parties, right? Because that's what we all want. We need people at our parties. Um, there are several leaders who absolutely swear that you have to do it one way or another, and I completely disagree with that notion. <laughs> um, I think that the best way to approach your business is to find what works for you. So um, there are leaders who will require a guest list of their hostesses and will not do a party without a guest list. Okay, that's fine, that's valid. If I were your hostess and you required a guest list of me, I wouldn't do a party with you because I'm not going to give you that contact information. Um, but what I do, I offer to send invitations for them and I offer them a bonus gift. So if they do get me a guest list, then I will give them something additional. Um, and that guest list can be in any format. I use post calls to deliver voicemails. So if somebody you know gives me a list of phone numbers, I will utilize post calls, which is a system you can purchase calls. Um, I think they're like seven cents a piece for direct salespeople. Um, but you type in the phone numbers as a list, and then you call, record a message, and it shoots it out to everybody all at once. So if you've got 15, 20, 150 people on your guest list, it doesn't matter. You can do it all in the same amount of time. Um, I also have postcards that I'll send out as invitations. Sometimes I'll use the corporate invitations that are available. Either way is totally valid. Um, or I'll do an evite or use the corporate invitation system. You know, that's totally valid as well. They do have to get me that information for me to do that for them. And like I said, I offer it as an additional service. But I don't require it because, again, I would be that hostess that says, mm, no. <laughs> what I do is I set up a Facebook event for all of my hostesses, unless they're not on Facebook, in which case then we talk about other methods of invitation. I set that up so that I can control the information that is going out to their guests. Then all they really have to do is click the invite button and drop in all of their friends. That's really it. It's very, very simple. And I go on there and I post things every couple of days to keep people interested, keep people engaged, get them excited about the party, and to make sure that it stays in their notifications so that they keep remembering that the party is happening. Um, I also send out text messages for my hostess to forward out as reminders. The day that she books, I'll send her a text message that says, save the date, I'm having a passion party on such and such a date and I want you to be there. And you know, she forwards that out to everybody she knows. Then um, three weeks beforehand, I'll send a text message just asking if she has any questions. Two weeks before the party, I'll send her a text to forward out as a reminder. A week before the party, and then the day before the party. So people get text messages and they get the Facebook event. And that's really all that I do um, in terms of invitations, unless they want to take me up on my offer to receive a bonus gift for giving me a guest list, which I then require to be to me within a week of booking. So um, yeah, there are a lot of things that people will say is required and that you can make the guest or the, the invitation system as complicated as you want. I personally prefer to keep things easy, and requiring a guest list is also very stressful to me. Um, so if it stresses me out, I don't do it. <laughs> the business should not stress you out. This business is designed to be um, everything that you need it to be while working around your life. So if it adds stress, I say don't do it. Um, invitation systems don't have to be complicated, but you still can have that control and make sure that the guests are there and gonna show up by doing very simple things. Um, like I said, lots of different ways that you can do it. Email with either Evite or Punchbowl or the system that corporate has, post calls for voicemails, postcards and um, the paper invitations that corporate has available, those are great. Facebook text message, use one, use two, use all five, whatever you wanna do. Um, whatever works best for you. Oh, 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 oh,